welcome students now we are going to see some important mcqs for chapter 2 of basic chemistry name of chapter is corrosion its prevention and electrochemistry first question is the method of purification of blister copper is it is the electro refining method then second question is daniel cell is which type of cell it is primary type of cell question number 3 is write the reason behind peating corrosion peats or hole formation is there in peating corrosion then what is 1 faraday 1 faraday is equal to 96500 coulombs then galvanizing it is the example of anodic protection because in galvanizing zinc it is get uh, coated on iron and it protect the iron then tinning it is the example of cathodic protection what immerse corrosion is called it is called as direct chemical corrosion then what atmospheric corrosion called it is called as dry corrosion then question number 9 is corrosion of metal means that is decay of metal or destruction of metal then question number 10 is metal at the top of electrochemical series these are the most active metal they are also known as anode type then electrochemical equivalent may be defined as the weight of substance deposited by passage of 1 coulomb of electricity then electrode potential it is the tendency of metal to lose electron gain electron lose or gain electron and the answer is to lose and gain electron both combine it is known as electrode potential while in question number 13 oxidation potential that is tendency to lose electron reduction potential it is the tendency of metal to gain electron then food stuff container should not be galvanized because it causes poisonous product with food then which process is used for coating superior metal on base metal electroplating method is used for coating superior metal on base metal which process is used for obtaining pure metal from impure metal electro refining it is used for obtaining pure metal from impure metal then which of the following is weak electrolyte nh4oh is weak electrolyte which of the following is strong electrolyte hcl is strong electrolyte some other examples may be there compounds formed by ionic bonds are good conductor of electricity compounds formed by electro uh, sorry covalent bond are poor conductor or bad conductor of electricity which is an electrolyte out of this four sodium chloride is an electrolyte which metal is coated on iron during galvanizing zinc is coated on iron when aqueous solution of silver nitrate is used an electrolyte during electrolysis the iron goes to cathode it is silver iron generally metal ions goes to cathode the weight of substance deposited in 1.34 g uh, calculate current in ampere when the process of electrolysis is carried out in 4 minute given ece that is z it is given 0.001118 you have to calculate the weight of and the answer is 4 ampere it is the current name the mechanism of corrosion in given situation a metallic structure with two dissimilar metals built in a river polluted with acidic waste from nearby industry and the mechanism is hydrogen evolution because acidic waste is present therefore there is evolution of hydrogen gas in this reaction cell the overall cell reaction is which type of whether oxidation reduction or redox it is redox type of reaction that means for uh, anode oxidation and for cathode uh, reduction takes place therefore it is redox reaction the metal which is placed at the top of electrochemical series these are the more active metal the process of decomposition of electrolyte in presence of electric current it is called as electrolysis then question number 30 is the mathematical expression of faraday's first law is w is equal to zct the method of electrolysis which is used to improve corrosion resistance of any metal it is 
all three that is electroplating electro refining and electrolytic reduction then which ions moves to anode during electrolysis and ions are moves to anode then the non rechargeable cell these are called as secondary cell secondary cells these are also called as non rechargeable cell then write the type of potential developed at copper electrode when deep in copper sulfate solution reduction potential is developed at copper electrode underground part of buried electric pole undergoes corrosion due to what due to differential difference in air concentration or you may say differential aeration galvanized metal cannot be used for storing food stuffs when two dissimilar metals are electrically connected then more active metal becomes anode and it get protected sorry it get corroded it is the answer d it is the answer more active becomes anode and it get corroded the metal which is commonly used as a coating metal during electroplating of imitation jewelry it is silver the process due to which water split up into hydrogen ion and hydroxyl ion it is known as dissociation in the figure given below part a represent what this is part a it represent molten tin at 232 degree celsius their electrovalent compounds are soluble in water as they have high ionization powder power then the substance which allow electricity to pass through them in liquid state they are called as electrolyte in daniell cell the cell reaction are oxidation at zinc and reduction at copper then the product obtained at cathode during electrolysis of aqueous copper sulfate solution using copper electrode it is pure copper at cathode the chemical reaction in the secondary cell is reversible during electro refining of blister copper the percentage of uh, h2so4 added to the electrolyte to increase its dissociation then electrochemical equivalent of metal is y gram per coulomb the equivalent weight of metal is y into uh 96500 that is chemical equivalent ce is equal to 96500 into ace name the type of corrosion when steel pipe is connected to the copper plumbing galvanic corrosion take place or galvanic cell formation that means when two dissimilar metals are come in contact with each other under the humid condition or humid atmosphere the reaction that occurs at cathode when iron hinges are plated with copper this is the reaction at a uh, copper electrode this is the uh, this is all about second chapter uh, tomorrow we are going to see some important mcqs of uh, chapter 3 and overall for all three chapters next video will be depend on that chapter 3 thank you